completed MBA in HR and BCom computer application. But uh, can freshers find jobs in New Zealand? Again, I think freshers will obviously be at a disadvantage as compared to somebody who has got experience because obviously that person uh, who has got experience uh, has uh, been in a work environment already even if it is not in New Zealand they have a so obviously it is like it is like if you choose two batsmen you know I'm just using a cricket anal analogy right now uh, has a guy who's just making his debut has got more chances of scoring runs for a guy who's already been playing for you know the last four five years obviously experience counts but having said that, uh, if you are a confident person, and I think for freshers, the key is communication. If your communication is right up there and you can speak fluently and you can be confident and you can say, yep, I, I guess I'm a fresher, but I can get this job done. I don't think there is a problem. And you have twin uh, kind of a background and because you've done you know, become computer application. So you have some element of computers uh, to you and you also have completed an MBA in HR so doing a course in management is good because uh, what will happen is you could potentially look at getting yourself into a job in uh, something to do with the IT industry because you've done something in computer application or uh, in the HR industry because you've already done an MBA in HR and also if you're coming for a generic applied management uh, course you could become a sales and marketing guy an admin guy or you know various other things Will it be easy? As I keep saying, it is never going to be easy. It's going to be a very tough challenge. And that's what you need to come prepared for, knowing that it is going to be tough. In fact, some other guy recently wrote to me saying, uh, now you seem to suggest that it is easy to get jobs in New Zealand. I never said that. Nobody in my team says that. It is not going to be an easy affair. Even for people with experience, I don't think it's going to be easy to find jobs in New Zealand. Because you're uprooting yourself and coming into a new country, into a new culture. It's going to take some time for those roots to settle down first. And then you can go around and start looking for jobs. So we'll never ever say it is easy. But what we'll say is if you're confident and if you are good, great in your, good in your communication skills or exceptional in your communication skills, I think it's worth a shot because the trade-off is do I take that risk? If you take the risk and you crack the job and a lot of young people do that with or without experience. They're finding jobs and going to get residency and living in one of the most beautiful countries on earth. So that's what you gain with the trade-off against that risk that you're taking. And that's what I keep telling, you know, we are trying to provide as much safety as possible to our clients. And so we'll work with you. We will guide you. We will advise you. We'll help you with your CVs and your cover. We will network you with some of our old, uh, you know, uh, students. I just shared that one of our previous students is now working as a recruitment consultant. So we will maximum, we'll try and help and support as much as we can. But getting that job will primarily be your responsibility. And so take, take the risk if you are uh, a confident young person uh, and good in communication, absolutely worth taking the risk.